This galaxy. Galaxy. I don't even know what type of game this is, it looks like a side-on shooter. Nothing left to lose now! Yeah, that father gas grind's a douche, man. I fucking got him so close to death. One, one fucking, I don't know, I could have licked his leg and he would have died. But unfortunately, it just didn't work out. Like, I'm really gutted about that, actually. X Squadron, report in. Y Squadron, report in. Anybody? Here, I'm here. Identify yourself. ATAC. ATAC? Yeah. Your launch ship's intact. Where is the regular radio op? No, it's gone. I'm in a Galak S fighter. Kurokawa's ship. He got hit before they launched. And I'm as good as gone. I've got a dead stick. ATAC, I need you to concentrate. You're the last fighter left. Cycle through your systems. Let's calibrate that steering. I'm going to have you aim at the targets. Aim down. Just point the stick in the direction you want to aim. I am. <laughs> oh, fucking hell, I thought it good. Aim up. at the next target. Okay, good. I was even You're trying to get that fucking arrow over there. Test fire oh, your stupid. lasers. Working. Check your forward thrusters. Thrusters, good. It looks good. Remember, steering and thrusters work together. Now, your reverse thrusters. Yeah, got it, got it. When using thrusters, a faint blue bubble around your ship shows the distance enemies can hear you. Looks like your controls are working. Oh yeah, coming back online. What happened? The Imperials. The Baron's entire fleet. They were waiting for us. Hammered us the moment our fleet came out of warp. I don't know how I managed to get us out of there. I don't know if anyone else made it. Okay, I've got a read on your signal. You're a... ATAC? I need you to listen and do exactly as I say. It's bad, right? 
I mean, th there's no way that doesn't mean I'm screwed. Well, you're in a narrow band of asteroids surrounded by Imperial Dreadnoughts. Those rocks are probably preventing them from scanning you. There's a gap in their coverage on the far side of the belt. Make it there and I can warp you back. First, I want you to head to this large asteroid. It seems to be hollow. You'll be able to use it for cover as you fly through it. I've marked it on your guidance system, so just follow the targeting arrow. Okay, voice on the radio. I guess I'll trust you. This voice on the radio is Beam, and I'm bringing you to the science vessel Axelios. Okay, Beam. Here's to hope. Let's make sure your boosters are functional. Just hold down boost. Whoa! Watch your engine temp. You have to give it time to cool down between boosts. Adam Takamoto, Academy Class of 23. Yeah, are you pulling up my records? Zero confirmed kills. Look, lady, you can confirm everything I just killed. Okay, okay. We just haven't worked together before. Just trying to understand who you are. I've reached a big asteroid, and there's definitely a cave system. Looks dark inside. Well, go in and keep reporting. Your shields will absorb all but weapons-grade collisions, so don't worry about bumping into walls. You can also break. Just hold both thrust buttons at once. Your shields will absorb initial blows, but they do need time to recharge. Get hit while your shields are down and you'll take permanent health damage. You'll see your shields represented as the blue bars on your HUD. The red bars indicate your health. A repair kit? Good find. Your salvage unit can suck it up. Micro machines repair health you've lost in battle. Ooh, that'll do. No. You've got probes between you and the exit. Take them out before they report you to the destroyers. Just keep firing and moving. Another one down! Take that! And that's mine. Oh, I'm out! Good! I found missiles nearby. It's on your way. Open your map to get a sense of- The gastroid be fucked. Love it. Missiles are back online. More probes. Be ready to take them out. Don't leave the cover of the asteroid field. Probe spotted. Test your missiles on them. Hold the missile button to open the targeter. Hold the targeter over enemies to build missile locks. Keep holding to lock on more missiles. Release to fire. <laughs> See ya! 
pretty cool the missile uh missiles like I've set up the beacon. Get to it and get out. Oh, sweet, sweet freedom. Don't get too cocky. The beacon signal rings out loud and clear, and there's a good chance they'll have sent someone to investigate. Not to mention all these dreadnoughts. Beam, they're getting closer. Well, so are you. Stingray. He's guarding the beacon. Looks like the Imperials got here first. Take him out. I'm hit! Target destroyed. Space junk. Fair enough. Because the missions will lose all current season progress, so be careful. Be five missions in a row without dying to unlock the next season. Without dying! You made it back. I can't believe it. You killed at least. I have a plan. Fight the Imperials, strike at their heart. Atak, you're the only pilot left. W what? After the ambush, the fleet. They're all gone. And our ship, the Axelios, is running out of water, power, oxygen. Did you signal for help? Our long-range communications and navigation are offline. That's bleak. That's tough. I don't know what you'll do. You're our only hope for survival. Can you keep us alive while I get our systems back online? Okay. I may be a new pilot, but lucky for you, I'm amazing. You can count on me. I will. Fingers crossed. I'm getting a signal. SOS! SOS! I was attacked by White Tusk and pinned in a cave behind an overreactive Imperial turret. My shields are fried, and I need extraction. That's Crash. Hey, Tack, get ready for your first mission. Right. The fleet wiped out, comms down, and navigation offline. We need all the help we can get. An old friend, an expert mechanic, is in trouble. If you offer him help, he just might do the same for us. Okay, there's a vessel in the area ahead. Find and escort my friend, Crash, and I'll open a warp point. Exactly who is this friend? 
A mercenary mechanic. Never trust a mercenary beam. This mercenary can make us weapons. Fine, I'll suspend my disbelief. Beam's mechanic friend crash. Is this unclear? Oh no, Beam, I understand. I understand everything. is Crash? He's a bit of a hermit. Keeps to himself. Likes the stuff he likes. Do you think he'll like me? Why not? Receiving fire! My shield to blow! Oh! <laughs> SOS. SOS. Calling any neutral parties within broadcast range. I am scuttled and require someone to take out an Imperial turret that has me holed up in this cave. I can reward you with weapons and parts. Yeah, oh, gosh. SOS, SOS. Requesting assistance. I'm pinned in a cave with down shields by an Imperial turret. Take that turret out for me, and I'll give you the best weapon in my stash. Deals on everything else, too. Man, I hate bugs! No, oh, not on the show. SOS. SOS. I need emergency extraction from this stupid cave. I'm pinned behind an overzealous Imperial turret, and my shield reactor is fried. Requesting immediate assistance. You will be rewarded. Taking damage! Huh? Taking Imperial fire! Shields out! Ah! Requesting immediate assistance. White Tusk is gone from the sector. Don't worry about him. Probably. Money in the bank. my shield anyway any sudden moves, pirate. I'm not a pirate. Crash, it's Beam. Beam? <laughs> Holy heck, is your timing great. Get me out of here. Aim to make a deal? Name your price. Trade for trade and a trip home to Earth. Signed and sealed. Then I'll spin up a warp beacon. Your new home sweet home. Seems okay, I suppose. This was our best explore the next time. Father fucking god. 
Asgard. <laughs> <clears throat> I'm going to end the stream here I'm going to go to bed and get some sleep uh, tomorrow now I won't be playing Bloodborne because I played it today tomorrow I should instead be playing Dying Light uh, if you want to tune in it'll be at 9pm UK time and in the day I might play some games as well so keep your eyes open give us a follow and you'll uh, get notified when I'm online next uh, thanks for tuning in I shall catch you soon bye